Today I'm going to show you how to get your RX 6000 AMD GPUs working with Mac OS okay so there's only one way I've got great news a lot of people have been asking me what about this update what about that update uh, you could not at all use the latest RX 6000 series so that includes 6700 XT, 6800, 6800 XT and 6900 XT with Mac OS under any circumstances. The only way you can do it is through what I'm going to show you guys. So first of all what you need to do is sign up to the Mac OS beta so it's, it'll, it'll, be in, it'll be included. So I've just gone through the beta update that has just been released overnight. I th it was the fourth beta update for the Mac OS uh, Big Sur 11.4 and in the footnotes and everything like that I saw that they will be introducing RX 6000 series support in Mac OS. Okay? So first things first, all I want you guys to do is go into, by the way, use DuckDuckGo if you don't want your privacy to be invaded and all your information to be stolen by Google. So anyways, you can put this in Google as well, Mac OS beta sign up. That's all you gotta do, go in here. Yeah. Or you can just copy this link and go in there. I'll put this link for you guys anyways. So then you'll have this page, okay? So in this page, you gotta go to Mac OS, okay? And log in with your Apple ID. If you don't have one, you gotta create one, okay? So after you've done that and everything like that, what you gotta got do is enroll your Mac into it, okay? And it'll take you to this page, okay? So uh, in this page, first of all, it says back up your Mac uh, machine. Uh, that'll be a good idea, going on to Beta would be a bit dangerous. Um, it's pretty safe. I've done it. This is beta. I'm running beta right now to record everything. Works absolutely fine for me. But if you don't know what you're doing, it's it, look, it's pretty safe. Should be fine, but it's up to you. It's a good idea always to back it up. Then you basically enroll your Mac by doing this. Download this uh, utility. Basically, it lets you enroll it. Then you go into download uh, uh, Mac OS beta okay public or you can just skip all this and wait for uh, Big Sur to be updated to 11.4 as normal and when once that's been updated if you've got an Intel Mac you can uh, just connect it so anyways going back to this and then you after it's uh, downloaded it you install it or you can uh, in the description below I've got a li another link and if you go to that link it has I have the link for the App Store, okay, uh, the Mac App Store, and it'll take you to this place where it has Mac OS Big Sur beta, okay, and you just can click that and it'll give you the latest fourth beta for the 11.4, which is the latest one. The size is about five gigs. I've got really fast internet where I am, and that'll download for me for like within 10 minutes. So, but if you've got slow internet. Please take it, it might take an hour for you to download after you've downloaded it updated restart your Mac plug in your eGPU and you should be good to go all right guys this channel survives on your subscriptions please do subscribe it's for free it doesn't cost you anything it'll ensure that I can create more quality content like this and that's basically it thank you for staying to the end I hope you find this useful please do comment below and let me know what you think about it. I thought Apple was never going to introduce RX 6000 series because of all the updates it's got with its own um, M1 chip and things like that. Looks looked like Apple wasn't going to have any of that but it's really exciting. I, I was excited this morning when I read this hence I did this really quick video for you guys to show you guys what it's all about. Thank you so much for watching. Take good care.